What's going on, y'all? You know, the Chicago game was an exciting game, right? Not only did we get clarification on the run defense, we was able to see Damon Clark, you know, in his debut, you know, and also we was able to see our newest addition, Mr. 95, Mr. Jonathan Hankins, y'all. The big boy that we've always been needed. The biggest man pretty much on the team. <laughs> they say he 340. Does that man look 340 to you? Man, he a potato chip away from 360. But who cares, right? As long as that man gonna stuff that middle. <laughs> we good, you know? <laughs> and so, you know... One thing Dallas has been missing, even though Quentin Bohannon has done an excellent job for us, right? We needed another nose tackle, not only for insurance, but as seen against Chicago to be able to stop the inside run. Now, I do believe that that will be the worst game that you see all year in the run defense, especially as we continue to grow. Dan Quinn, I'm sure of it, will be harping on technique. I'm sure DeMond Clark will continue to grow in. And I'm sure Jonathan Hankins will have a big, a big role in our success. I'm not going to say that we're going to be holding teams to be the number one rush defense all of a sudden. But if we can be functional and, and do a solid job with our pass rush, oh, it's over. Right? And we're going to get into what Jonathan Hankins means to this team. We already knew. We already seen what he did against the Giants, with the Giants in Oakland or Vegas, as you would call it. But now we get to see it in the Dallas Cowboys uniform. Our big man. I'm about man. I got tears in my eyes, man. I got to wipe my glasses off, man, with all these tears in my eyes, man. <laughs> but anywho, I'm pretty sure y'all ready to so see y'all, man, man, man. He talking too much, man. Let's get to the film, man. Y'all know how I get excited about this Cowboys football, y'all. But let's go ahead and get into it. Lined up on the center at the one. Boom. You ain't. That's all right, y'all. You know, he had a little help. But what did he do, though? The man got hit, blindsided, and still went four. He got hit, blindsided, and still went four. Boom. Center, you're not about to get to my boys. You're about to stand packed. You're not going nowhere. We needed this in Dallas. Once again, you're not going nowhere. Mr. Jonathan Hankins was in the middle on that play. Did you see the outcome? The outcome. Yeah, we causing piles up in here. Yes, that's what we're going to need in Dallas. He going to be, ooh, ooh, Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. But all right, let's get to the next play. <laughs> All right, now to our next play. I want you to look at how important this is, what he has did, what he did in this play. It didn't look fancy to the average fan, but it looked great. Look, boom. Two people to allow your linebacker to make the play. He did not allow them to get to the linebacker, y'all. Oh, my God, this is so beautiful. Did you see 11? Did nobody touch him? You see how nobody touched him? You see how he brought them boys? Ain't nobody touch him. He sacrificed himself for the team. And what I just said, we need people who going to sacrifice themselves for the betterment of this team. And he then took out two people to allow him to go underneath and make the play. That's so beautiful. Oh, my God. You have nobody like this. But now you do. <laughs> and look at the result. Do you see? The difference when you have a real nose. That's what a real nose is supposed to do. Do not, you're not about to, you're not about to run here. You're not about to touch my linebackers. Look how free Micah running. Look how he free he running. I thought I done heard Denise Williams singing. Lord have mercy. Moot make the play. Guys, let me look at it one more time, y'all. One more time, y'all. One more time. You know how beautiful that is? I lied to y'all, man. You know, you, you know, I got a bad habit of lying to y'all in the film session, y'all. 
Look at him, bam. He rolling with him, laterally, holding him so he can make the play. Do you know how important it's going to be from here on forward? <laughs> what? Yes, indeed, man. That's a beautiful sight to see. You know I can appreciate great nose play, y'all. And this play, nobody talks about, but was so important. All right, here's another one, man, that show is worth, man. You, you, you heard that song, A Woman's Worth by Maxwell? Well, Hank is worth. Ooh, look how he hold him. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> yeah, look how he holds him up. He said, boom, I'm no, look at him. He ain't going nowhere. The line like, damn, man, get off me, boy. Look at the strong shot. Ha! Squeezing him down. The nose is squeezed. The nose has, see the nose, see what, see what people don't understand is the, the D tackles have to squeeze as well. The D tackles have to squeeze as well, and he understands that. He carries him to eliminate any lanes. Look at the lane he eliminated. Look at that, which helps cause the traffic. Do you know how beautiful this is? This is beautiful. I just want you to know you're my favorite nose. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Yes, indeed. Beautiful, y'all. Oh, my God. I love nose tackle play. Oh, my God, I love nose tackle. Look. Oh, my God. <laughs> Beautiful, man. But we on to the next play. Here, my guy, number 95 right here. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. He's right here. Let's see what he do. Of course, you know, he's going to not get moved. Do you see how he stays square? Did you see how he not getting turned like number 91? You know, you see how he taking on both? They're not going nowhere. He stay. Yeah, sometimes you may give up a little bit of ground. You may take a step or two back. But so what? That's look at that. He's not giving up ground. That's what we want our big sloppy nose tackles to do. I will I like my nose tackles more sloppier than Joe. <laughs> you know? Beautiful. Beautiful. All right, man. Here go another one, man. Come on. What we on? What we on, Hank? What we on, Hank? Huh? Get off me. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Take them on. Huh? Use that power. Get them off me. Swim it off me. Short little swim off me. Whoo! Beautiful. Short little swim off me. Make sure the hands is free. Come here. Come here. <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, my gosh. The, hey, hey, the guard was like, man, I ain't about to move this, man. Go ahead. Good luck, center. I'm going to go ahead and go to that. Cha 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 cha, Charmin. <laughs> I ain't even going to worry about it. He ain't even worried about it. He gave a little tap like it was going to do something, man. He like, hey, man, you on your own. He said, oh, no, my brother. You got to go get your own. <laughs> yeah, man. This is so beautiful. Beautiful. Here go another one, man, where this man makes another sacrifice. He understands who he got back behind him. Rookie, late, Wilson. He said, hey, I'm going to let y'all be free. Look how he does. Boom. Hands on him. He takes him with him. Come on, man. He's a body right there. Oh, my God. Do y'all understand he made the play? Move lateral, made the play, brought him with He brought the, oh, my God. He brought him with him. Put him into the running back. Look at that. Boom. 
Of course, he had a little bit of assistance, you know, you know, you know, can't, can't take that away from a guy, you know, can't take that away from him, you know, can't take that away from Fowler. But Fowler in your nose. See, you see what happens when your D tackle and your ends on one accord, you get run plays like this. When your D line is, when, when your nose tackle is making a sacrifice, when your nose tackle is taking on two guys, See, he ain't get to the second level because he was off balance. He barely touched him, and look what he did to him. Look, he barely touched. Look at him. He got him off track. You want to get the line off track. This is beautiful nose play. Two guys. Stop the run and back momentum to make the play. See, I know y'all guys may be upset that we ain't make no move. But, man, this is probably one of the best moves that you're going to make all year. This is one of the better moves that you can make all year. This is a game-changing move. When you get everybody to start playing discipline, when you get everybody on one accord in that front seven, and you got a nose tackle playing like this, don't be surprised, man, if Quentin Bohannon, man, gets to that bench pretty soon. Not saying that he ain't going to play because he does definitely a lot, a lot of snaps for him. But don't be surprised, man, when you see uh, on a Sunday night football uh, Jonathan Hankins, man. In that starting lineup. You know? Look at my guy, man. You know he ain't going to give it his own pass rush. But you know I had to show him. You know he got a little something. So look, get a little push, man. You know he ain't going to do nothing. But you know. You know. Let's say, for instance, if he wanted to run up the middle. He wasn't going to do that. He wasn't going to do that. Because Big Hankins, you know what he was doing? He was playing both. He was playing both sides. He split them down the middle and made sure that he wasn't going to go. You know, make sure make sure he didn't pick a side. Soon as he seen him committed, soon as he seen him commit, soon as he seen him commit, he went to go commit. Now we know he ain't about to give us no bursts up the middle. We know he ain't about to give us no ten sacks. I believe he had one, maybe one or two good sack years. But you know, after that, it was a wrap. After that, you know, now he's strictly just stuffing the run. You know, look at that. Look at that. he playing it. He committed. Boom, got him. Mike could have caught a whole call on that. Mike could have got him with a whole call. You know? Mike could have got him with a whole call. Beautiful. Love to see it. Love to see it, y'all. Look at this man. Look, look who the center wasn't going to go nowhere. Look at him. Boom. Center in the backfield. Bounced him out. Just say he had no help outside contain. Just say he had no outside contain. If Michael would have kept outside contain... That's a tackle for loss. That's a tackle for loss. See, little technique stuff like that. He did his job. He even came downfield, hustled. He even hustled along the line. He did his job. He strung it out. Your DNs and linebackers got to make that play. Oh, my God. This was an excellent debut. Excellent debut by Jonathan Hankins. Excellent debut by Jonathan Hankins. Excellent. Gave us what we traded you for. Gave us what we traded him for. Come on. Just think if he would, this is a tackle for loss. If he makes, come on, man, he made the play. He played with shock. He didn't allow him to get into him. He got in there, look, he all up in his grill telling him what's for dinner. Boom. Straight had him go back. That's how you want your D-tackles to play. In they line. On they side. Boom. Got you going back. You're not going for it. Everybody else for it. But, see, look at that. Let me tell you something. Everybody else. Look at, look at the push that everybody else get. Come on. He down, right? But he's for it. You know? Simple things like that make a big old difference. Come on, man. A-plus trade for the Dallas Cowboys. Here's another play. On a zero, lined up, head up, lined up, head up, kept him free. Look at 11. He was trying to get to 11. He had an angle on 11, but he wasn't going to allow nobody to touch 11. He had an angle on 11, but by him holding him up, he didn't allow nobody to touch him. That's beautiful line play. He didn't allow nobody to touch his linebacker. Look how free your linebackers is running. Look how free your linebackers is running. 
Come on. Look how free they running. Osa, get your hand on somebody. You know? Look at the difference with him and look at the difference with him. You know? So this thing, if when Osa... See, Osa going to pick this up, though. He got under the handcuffs. He going to pick this up. He going to pick this up. They're going to learn this. You need somebody that's going to work hard. Don't need another body. Once they get on one accord, once Hankins hold them accountable, because I know he will, he going to be like, guys, I can't be the only one keeping our linebackers clean. Osa, we know you're not no sack man. You're going to have to help with this. Just think when Osa and Hankins and Quentin Bohannon gets on one accord in doing this, y'all. It's going to be, oh, my God, y'all. That's if, though. That's if. You know I had to show him a little rush. You know I had to show a little pass rush right here on Big Hank, number 95. He said, come on, scoot over. Come on. Look at Big Hank. Look at him working. Look at him working. Look at Big Hank working. Look at him working. <laughs> Look at Big Hank working. Look at Big Hank working. Yes, indeed. Look at Big Hank. He fired up. He fired up. He said, I'm winning now. We went from Las Vegas to Dallas. I'm winning now. I get to bring my stuff on a winning team. Look at Big Hank. Oh, let me go ahead and let Big Hank get a little extra juice on the man. Ring around a rosy. <laughs> yeah. You know what the time it is, man. But yeah, man. This, look, man. This trade was excellent. He will help tremendously. We just got to get everybody on one accord. But once we get everybody on one accord, this run defense should be drastically improved. I'm not saying we're going to be the number one rush defense in the league. But I'm saying is when it comes down to the playoffs, we're not going to get ran on, you know. Not saying, you know what I mean? Not saying, you know what I mean? The way that we get ran on now, it should be a whole lot different. Whole lot improved. Don't know how much improved, but just with Hankins alone, it'll be improved. Just by Hankins alone, your linebackers should make more plays. So just think when everybody else get on one accord regarding their technique. You know? But that is all, man. For those of y'all on TikTok, go ahead and hit go ahead and hit that sub. If you're viewing this on YouTube, you see that little thing right there. You know that little circle right there? Might as well go ahead, tap that thing, go ahead, subscribe. You know you enjoyed this video, just like I enjoyed making it. But all right, y'all, we up out of here.